What up y'all, it's Titor, and today we're gonna be talking about a leak that's been floating around for what Pokemon Presents might announce. It's remakes of black and white in ILCA style. I'm gonna show you screenshots right now. It's these. You got, you got Getsis? <laughs> Why is it black two and white two Getsis? And we got N, and they're obviously in chibi graphics like BDSP, so we're gonna talk about these. And as you can see in the title, they're fake, probably. I actually saw these yesterday when we were looking at the buyer hazardous content on Twitter. <laughs> this was my reaction. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Yo, who's who's spreading this, huh? That is nightmare fuel. Wait, look at ugly ass Zetsu. I mean, gets this. Oh my goodness. Now we know it's fake. Do we know this is fake? <laughs> the weirdest part about this is it looks so believable. I mean, you can imagine an ILCA Pokemon black and white future. You know, Pokemon vast white and deep black. IOCA black and white remakes chibi style and I guess they include black two and white two content so we got gets us here and then look at that end of course it's so blurry imagine waiting like 14 years for black and white to be remade and they essentially look the same just in 3d listen the truth is there is a good chance this will happen that we would get chibi black and white remakes by ilca at least you know just trying to read pokemon's patterns but in that case it would be one of two games for unova and that would be the lesser game so i've done some digging of where these pictures actually originate from and it's 4chan many people know by this point what's happening on pokemon presents while everyone's preparing for the big reveal so all you have to have is one of the people who know to slip up and do it it happens all the time it happened in 2021 pokemon legends arceus gameplay of it was leaked like a few hours before the pokemon direct or the pokemon presents but anyhow it seems to stem from this one right here uh, this is actually from february 12th 2024 so that's about eight days ago how long has it been since we looked at 4chan leaks let's give this a good look pokemon presents will be showing oh my goodness Did they really say february 24th all right let's give them the benefit of the doubt maybe they slip it in some false info to take people off their trail the pokemon presents will show off news for pokemon go series card game series scarlet and violet dlc and we'll show off the new pokemon black and white remake wow I mean, listen, I'm not going to entirely throw away the possibility of Scarlet and Violet DLC. It just seems very unlikely. But this whole post looking freaking ass. And we'll show off the new Pokemon Black and White remake. The remake will again be handled by ILCA and will look basically the same as Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl. Oh, look, the remake will be called Pokemon Deep Black and Vast White. I guess this really is a popular name. It's Deep Black and Vast White because that's what Zekker and Rushram's Pokedex titles are. The Deep Black Pokemon, the Vast White Pokemon. They are simple titles to be able to give to ILCA remakes and will contain both Black and White and two. Bro, I'm not so sure about that. Listen, if Pokemon, Game Freak, I'll say, if they're trying to maximize profits, why would they make Black 2 and White 2? They might as well, if they're gonna make it, make it down the road. All they have to do to deliver a product is make the first ones. So it's just my opinion, but I find it a little less believable. The ending of the presents will show off the next series of Legends game. This one taking place in the Unova region. You know what? Maybe we can look at this post more believably. Not that I believe in this post. The Scarlet and Violet DLC could really be referring to the final mythical Pokemon, right? That is technically the last part of the DLC. And that just this is pretty much what we're expecting for Pokemon Day, right? If Unova and I'll see any game free game like this. Oh, he's back. Apologies. The presents will be on the 27th, not the 24th. The price tag will be 70 US or $40 US for just deep black and vast white. What is this man talking about? Bro, so you saying 70 bucks for the Legends Unova game. 40 bucks for a whole ass Nintendo Switch game? Fam, that's what we want, obviously. That's pretty much the price they were back on the Game Boy. And if you're going to give us BDSP, which kind of just looks like it could have been a DS game, give it for 40 bucks. But that's not how it's going to happen. This would be the price of a full ass Switch game. I don't know what this man's talking about. But anyhow, the 4chan post then just descends to people posting other fake leaks that have surfaced on 4chan in the past. Like this one of Coco fighting some crab. Then you got this of Mega Charizard fighting look what looks like a Weavile. Mega Weavile. <laughs> Dude, I found new screenshots that aren't these two. Look at this one. Ooh, it doesn't get more blurry than this. But first, I'll take down this disgusting trainer with my... 
Ooh, he got that black Kirim beside him. So you know why this is so blurred? Because that's literally a PNG of black Kirim. You know what? Let's actually find this. <laughs> My dudes. Look at this, okay? So here we go. Here's what he posted, right? <laughs> Let me put a picture of black Kirim. <laughs> that, is the, that is the exact same pose. With his arm here and he's facing there. I mean, of course, black Kirim would be posed the same way generally. But fam, that's, that's quite literally what's there. Oh my god, I found him again. Correcting misinformation. This image in question was captured by me and shared exclusively within my private Discord server a few days ago, bro. Bro, what leaker's gonna keep coming back to Keyboard Warrior defend himself and his leaks? Despite my explicit instructions to the members of my Discord to not share this photo with anyone online, it seemed that someone posted on 4chan despite my request. I kindly urge to remove this content from Reddit. To address any misinformation, I cannot confirm whether the image is related to a black and white remake. I'm employed as a janitor in Minato City. While cleaning an unnamed office building, he took a photo of the computer screen. You want to give these leaks one more one more shot? Let's read one more of these that got posted to 4chan that seems believable. One of y'all sent me this. It was posted and has 400 upvotes. It just came out on 4chan. I'm sorry, Unova Remake doesn't actually exist. It's just a new DLC for Scarlet and Violet where you can travel to Unova. The white version of Unova if you play Violet, the black version if you play Scarlet. This quite literally will never happen. Let's see if I eat my words in a week. Freaking $50,000 that that crap will never happen. And yeah, let's just circle back to the chibis. So just to keep y'all's expectations as grounded as possible, just pretend and expect it is chibis that you're getting for one of these games, okay? If it's Unova, you got LCA chibis and the Game Freak game. If it's Johto, let's go chibis and potentially something else. Those are the two leading ideas. The Scarlet and Violet DLC is less likely. And then finally, the last thing to say is if we want to take Ku's hints into account and how he's merging Unova and Johto, there's a chance that somehow, even though this doesn't make that much sense, it would be both a Johto and a Unova game this year. One of them being the ILC edition, one of them being the Game Freak edition. And maybe this could span for the next two years. So it could be a Johto and Unova project side by side that will take up the next two years. Which again, at that point, why not just split it year by year and separate them? But who knows? Game Freak's always trying to throw curveballs. I'm just trying to tell you all, all the current popular possibilities. And then we can see where it goes from there. Make sure y'all shank that like button. Let me know your thoughts. Obviously, I don't want Unova in chibi graphics like this. But I just want y'all to just expect it. So that you can only look up from there. Six days until Pokemon Day. Let's keep the hype train going. And I'll see you on the next one. Take care.